morning guys well <laughs> uh, we've made it to 1,000 videos this one upload now is upload 1000 zero, zero, zero. 1,000 videos <sighs> it's been quite quite the ride to say the least and uh, you know it's it's because of you people, you folks, my subscribers, that keep me uploading videos and keep wanting to put you know, content out there for you. I know a lot of you are really, really interested in, in what I'm doing. Um, and I mean, I have to thank all of every one of you. I mean, you know, right now I'm also coming up to 4,000 subscribers. So it's it's mind blowing how far we've come with this channel and I have to thank all of you people, all of you, all my subscribers for uh, you know, for believing in me and for continuing to want more content. And uh, you know, it's awesome. I gotta say, it's awesome. Um but a, I don't know, a few days ago I asked I said, what should I do to my, you know, the video on for the 1,000 video? And, you know, I was thinking, um, uh, you know, there's people that want me to do, you know, video on Cybernet radios. I've seen that. And, uh, right now I haven't even got a Cybernet radio. So, I mean, for me to even do, you know, a review on one or whatever, it's kind of, kind of pointless. <laughs> but, um... One thing that I think that I've built that a lot of people have commented on, commented on, and I was asking about it and you know questions about it and how I built it. If I'm building schematics, block diagrams, whatever for it, the number one project I think that I've built, most proud of building, is what I have over there on that desk and it's currently you know it I haven't got it in operation but you know it does work and that would be my VHF UHF crossband repeater that I built and uh, a lot of people really interested in the controller that I built for the crossband repeater and you know when I built that controller, I never had anything to go on. You know, the only thing that I went on when I built that controller was the rules and regulations of being able to operate a crossband repeater. That would be your, you know, the ID got to be sent every so often. Um, it's got to be able to send its ID on both VHF and UHF bands because. A crossband repeater legally is supposed to send an ID on to the bands that it operates on because there is two transmitters in use. There's a transmitter on the UHF side and there's a transmitter on the VHF side. So you can't just ID on one band and not on the other. In order to keep the crossband repeater legal, it has to ID on both bands, UHF and VHF. So, I, uh, you know, I came up with a plan to make that So, this would be the crossband repeater. This is the one that I have to say was one of the most interesting projects that I built over the years. <laughs> um, especially, like I say, the controller. A lot of people interested in this thing. It's, uh, it's an interesting uh, setup, to say the least. Uh, still got to try to make a, you know, a schematic or a block diagram or something. Because there's actually, well, there's two. There's another controller right here, and but the main controller is this one here. So we've got the. That's actually since the audio ID is this board here. I bought that one off eBay. Uh, DTMF control board this one here so basically all they need to do is set up a receiver 
plug it into the audio jack of a receiver, plug it into the jack, and send the DTMF codes on a different frequency than what the crossband repeater is working on. So the crossband is currently set up for 146.900 megahertz at 233.6 hertz tone and on the UHF side she's 443.2 megahertz and also 233.6 hertz that's on receive and transmit um, so the actual controller is pretty cool uh, if I just want to change the ID to whatever basically all I do is press this here button and talk into that there microphone element <laughs> and uh, let go of it and then however long the transmission is well then I compensate with it with this blue LED here on this controller so basically this is the countdown I have it set for uh, 500 seconds which I think is like I don't know 10 minutes and the 5 that's the actual transmit time so when she keys up she'll key up for 5 seconds and she'll let go and then she goes count down again for 500 it's very easy to set this one uh, so I can change the timing to whatever I want just hit the, hit the set button as you can see she's at 5 I can press the up button keep it on and she'll just go up to whatever I want or I can press down and set it down to whatever I want and then hit it again and I can change my ID transmit time down here on this one. Just hit set again and that's it. She's good to go. That's how that's it. But uh, yeah, I got to say it's an interesting setup. Um, I did uh, on the ID, I actually changed the ID today. It was set up to uh, what uh, this the VO1 HMS crossband repeater. Uh, today I set it just for uh, V1 HMS crossband. So here we have it. But this I have to say is one of the more interesting projects that I've made. So there we have it. Anyway guys. Hope you enjoyed the little video I got put up here. This little mismatch of everything. And uh crossband repeater I was working with her actually between doing this video and the last video. Actually the video before that. <laughs> today and in this one of working on the crossband repeater on and off there most of the day working at a few little bugs but uh, managed to uh, figure her out I got the audio levels pretty much the same now on the VHF and the UHF side had a little issue with the uh, with audio levels there but uh, had to do a little couple of mods there to straighten that out but anyway uh, once again thank you everybody for hang with me there for uh, for uh, 1,000 videos and to all of our soon to be 4,000 subscribers let's uh, let's bring her on this again we got the, I got a contest coming up I really have no idea what I'm going to do for that I'm still up and you know still trying to make up my mind but uh, We'll see how that goes. But anyway, here we have it. That's 1,000 videos as of right now. Thank you, everybody. And uh, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do so. And uh, thumbs up. Click the bell. You know the drill. Anyway, guys, take her easy. 7-3. We'll chat later. It's right now 63. We're out of here. Ciao. Crossband repeater.